Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today is part four of my spring cleaning series. So if you like clean with me videos or cleaning motivation, this is your place to be. I'm a mom of three from the Netherlands and last August we moved to a much bigger house than our previous one. So I had to come up with a different cleaning system and sometimes the cleaning in a big house can be a bit overwhelming. So now at the arrival of spring, I am taking it easy. I clean one room at a time. I use a simple to-do list and I tackle all the tasks step by step. So far I did the master bedroom, the bathroom and our laundry room and today I deep cleaned the room of my eldest son Louis. I'm a working mom so I simply can't do all the cleaning at once. It is, is usually is an hour here, an hour there. Uh, so yeah, that's that's how I roll. If you like to follow me, I make a lot of cleaning videos but also simple cooking videos and routine videos. So I would love you to consider hitting the subscribe button down below. And if you like cleaning videos, make sure to let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up. So now that all the bedding is in the Washer, I use these scrubbing gloves to clean the windows. Uh, I use warm water with a drop of dish soap and with these gloves it is the perfect match. So I got a lot of reactions on these gloves so I will link them in the description down below. I don't mind cleaning the windows at all, uh, definitely not in combination with this window vacuum. It is super easy and handy. It soaks up all the dirty water, there is no leaking, no mess, no stripes. This is one of my favorite cleaning products and I will try to link some more of my favorite cleaning products down below in the description. And take away holy days left in despair, air is getting heavier. But I do my best to breathe But I do my best to breathe Some green and filled with this Life is so much more than this So where do you go When nothing's like home? So as I mentioned, we moved into this house last August after a lot of renovations. Uh, I'm almost finished with this room, so I'm waiting for a few more items and then the only thing missing are some curtains. And because of COVID, all the shops are closed for a long time, so I didn't have a chance to go and hunt for a good color and a good fabric for the curtains. Um, and to be honest, I'm getting a bit impatient. So I feel like going to Ikea soon and choose something that I can hang the same day. I think custom-made Roman blinds will take forever again but on the other hand we are waiting for so long already so maybe well I don't know we will see <laughs> I'm, I can be so indecisive when it comes to interior stuff so I made a mood board for this room and it's slowly coming together so definitely stick around if you want to see the end result um, I'm making like a, a makeover or transformation video uh, whatever you want to call it um, I did share some sneak peeks on my Instagram stories and yeah so follow me there if you have an Instagram account you can find me under Lenny underscore love underscore chaos or check the links in my description down below <music> Okay, the wardrobe is a mess. I let my kids put away their clean laundry um, and they do help out with these chores, but keeping the wardrobe tidy is such a challenge for them. My eldest son knows how to iron shirts even, but the folding is so hard for him. 
Um, my other five-year-old child is so much better at folding. She's really handy with that stuff, but her closet is a mess too. And that's, that's just because she likes to change her outfit 20,000 times on a day. Uh, leave me a comment if anyone can relate to that. Um, yeah, at least they help out a little, I believe, in, in, in raising capable kids. So on the day that they will be on their own, they are independent and they can take care of themselves and their household. I think they're never too young to learn some simple chores and help out with the day-to-day -day tasks. You and I meant for me, still not surprising. Need no apologies, cause that's don't really care what you think, what you think, what you think. Bed sheets smell so nice and fresh. There is nothing better than going to bed with clean sheets. Um, and because of the scent pearls, the scent booster that I always use on the bed sheets, the whole room smells super nice. So that is another room done of my spring cleaning series. If you want to catch up on the other videos, I will link part one, two, and three down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you back next time. Goodbye. Take care. Shame on me, thinking it was just a